Hey everybody, John Good, Senior Vice President DW. We're here at the 2019 NAM show out in front of our booth because they don't let me in there anymore. So they put my drum set outside with me. But uh, this is like my buddy. Uh, 15 years ago, I got a hunk of this wood near my desk and I didn't know who gave it to me or where it came from. But I, I sent it to the, my mentor in Michigan, Don Sadler, and he said, stay away from it, it's firewood. Don't do anything with it. So after someone says no, no, no enough, he just sent me back a block that he chopped out of it and it became a paperweight on my desk. 15 years go by. If anybody knows me, I'm a creature of habit. I eat at the same place every Friday night. I eat at the same place for lunch for 22 years. And I always have the same seat. And so uh, all of a sudden, all these years later, there's a guy sitting in my seat. And I was just incensed by it. And I said, you bastard, how could you? In my mind, my wife is convinced I need to see a professional person about this. But anyway, I sat there and sulked next to him. And the guy told us the specials that night and he said, oh, they forgot to tell you what I'm having. And all I could think was, you're in my chair. So um, he told us, it's the veal Milanese is to die for, blah, blah, blah. And before I know it, he's now lonely. So he's showing his pictures of his wife and his daughter having a mother-daughter tr travel in, in uh, Florence, Italy. And we get, you know, time goes by and he tells me what he does. He's an entrepreneur for marketing. He did Italy, Bubba Gump, Shrimp, Cheers. So the guy's got credentials now. So I'm sitting there and he says, yeah, you know, my, my, my wife's family, they're all farmers. And I said, what do they farm? He said, almonds. Then I got, wait a second. He says, do you know the proper pronunciation? I said, it's Ammon. And he goes, you know, north of Sacramento, it's Ammon. South of Sacramento, it's Almond. So anyway, one thing led to another. And we all went up to Arbuckle, California together. And his name was Jonathan Zeely. I took my shell guy, my video guy, and my wife, Esther, goes everywhere with me. And we got 70 trees. I just had to do it. They're little guys. So we had to really turn it into a short lathe cutting session, which uh, we did in Ohio. I am not allowed to go back to Ohio because we broke four blades doing it. This stuff is so hard, it's out of this world hard. So long story short, or super long story, a little shorter, we, we had to figure out how to make this stuff work. And we got the veneer back, and it is ratty, horrible stuff. Makes my crew really appreciate maple that comes four by eight and behaves itself. This stuff is hard to work with, but at the end of the day, we made a staggered tandem core for the center and vertical on the outside, which when you bend it around into a shell, creates such incredible, luscious, wonderful bottom end because of the hardness. It's 1700 on the Jenka scale, in case anybody cares about that. And so the top is there. It's really true mid-range. I know I've said this before about every project I do, but this has become my favorite drum set. And I want to share something with you. These nuts right here, actually they're seeds, are almonds. If you read the label, they come from the kitchen of Esther Good. My house turned into a machine making almonds and she does such an incredible job. You're gonna have this package before we're done. And we were able to make 50 kits out of those 70 trees and 50 snare drums. Each kit looks entirely different than the next one, which makes it really, really attractive and wonderful. After those 50 kits, we're gonna cool down till the harvest happens next year, and we're gonna make them every season. We're going back for more. So as a seasonal, manufacturing schedule and when you play these drums I swear to God it will change you it's they were bringing these old trees new life and by the way I have a tendency to swim in the shallow end of the spiritual pool but there was a reason that guy was in my chair that's my story about almonds I hope you all have a great time we're having a great time here at NAM and for drum my friends 
thank you so much for being here and thank you for this interview and we'll have a good time and I'll show you what's next next time. <laughs>